So as per usual, we embark today on a new documentary. And whenever we do this, uh, God save us. I always put boom in front of the camera. And we do the same bullshit over and over. So, Mr. Boom Operator, tell us about yourself. I appreciate you calling me Boom Operator. That's really... <laughs> Mr. Boom Operator. It's per I, th I think you do it to just impersonalize the whole interaction that we have together. Yeah. Um, so what do you want, just like stuff about me and my life? Yeah. Just Let's talk about... Well, one thing that you're very proud of is your, your, your other job, right? Yeah, of course. Tell us about your other job and how you got into that. I counsel recovering addicts. Noble uh, profession, sir. Yeah, I think so. I, I do too. So. I like to help people. Um, and I do so because I had a little bit of a spotty past myself. My uh, girlfriend at the time uh, and I were kind of on the party circuit. She got pregnant and we had a son. And uh, um, he, uh, I wasn't, uh, sorry. Alright. <laughs> uh, I want to give him a good life. I want to be a good dad. I had the green light. And a truck carrying drywall. I wanted to forget everything. I wanted to just numb out. And I did. And I did so pretty hardcore. For a year, I lost my job, lost my car, got repossessed. Luckily, my mom <clears throat> stuck by me and uh, said, we're going to get you some help. Various stages, uh, 60 days, and uh, I grew to enjoy that. And, uh, you know, uh, it just pained me to see people going through what I had gone through. I started counseling. Uh, on the side, you know, to help people, and uh, I do that during the day and uh, help you when I can. We want to tell the stories, don't we? We do want to tell stories. That's right, brother. So. All right.